Going to go through the two-year-olds really quick. Most of these horses are out and coming back anywhere between December, well, middle of November to Christmas. Uh, Affection will likely be somewhere towards the end of November. We'll bring her back in. Ali Baba's racing tonight for 120000 She's a long shot, but she's still racing in there. So good luck to Ali Baba and Jim and all my partners with her. Um, we'll see how she finishes off her season, and then she'll go out. She likely won't be back till Christmas. Hi, beautiful. What are you doing? Mm-hmm. 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 Um, Arson races tomorrow in Kentucky I'm excited about racing this guy I haven't seen him since Oak Grove uh, Blanton's Blue is out in the field He'll come back in December 1st We'll get him back going Born to Dance December 1st Did not know is jogging in um, Jogging Actually she might have started training already in Ontario uh, in Interested to see how this filly does This is Jacob and his, and his brother I think And his grandfather's horse We'll see how she does. Uh, don't talk about Bruno. We'll stay out till almost to Christmas. I'm going to give him lots of time out in the field. Drebin will be coming back in around December the 1st. Easy on the turns. is only a few weeks away from the races. Max. She's been training good, I've been told. Electric line. I was happy to hear that Harry loved this horse. Harry really, really liked the way he was jogging and training back. So excited to see how this guy... Yeah? Are those rain clouds? Yeah, they are rain clouds. Good eyes. Um, Flashfly will come back in December the 1st. We'll get Flashfly back going. George of the Jungle will come back in a couple of weeks. We'll get him fired back up I and going. I love Flashfly. She's pretty. Yeah, I like yeah. her too. Why did she go away? She went out to the field to relax with her friends and eat some grass. Oh. Yeah, we'll bring her back in on December the 1st. Do you know what December the 1st is? No. My birthday, you turkey. Um, great bet out in the field also. We'll bring him back in around the 15th of December. Give him lots of time to relax for the fall. Gypsy Hill, same thing, December 15th with him. Hallie in the Clouds is back in now going. She hasn't started training yet, but she's jogging. I'm fancy like out to the field now. We'll bring her back in around, same thing, December 15th or so. Insider trading around December 1st. We'll bring her back in. International Spy is jogging now. He'll start training soon in Ontario. Um, Jayport Beach Boys out in the field till around December. Ah, uh, we'll give him time. Around December 15th. Lonely Lakewood will come back in December 1st. We'll start going with him somewhere in that first part of December area. Uh, Lovers Play. I, I, I'm so excited. All I asked Enos to do, so Enos, our blacksmith, she's out at his farm. Big Amish farm. I said just keep her sound, keep her happy. Let her run all day long if she wants to. Let her eat lots of grass. I'd like to see her put on a couple of hundred... I'd like to see her put on a couple of hundred pounds and come back in. So that's when she's going to come back in in about 150 pounds. That's when she's going to come back in. Uh, what are you doing, babe? Oh, it was, it was stuck? Oh. Um, Mick Paisley, she's just getting finished up, getting healed up and rehabbed, and then she'll go out to the field for six weeks. Mel Gibswan went out uh, tonight. He's getting picked up and turned out in Illinois. Um, at the farm out there. We'll bring him back in around December the 15th. Memory and Imagination. He's still got racing. Another month of racing almost ahead of him. And then we'll turn him out till Christmas time. Militant will come back in first part of December. Mounds for All. Same thing as Mal. Mel. Uh, he goes out tonight. He'll likely be out till Christmas time. No chance in Hill. He's going to get two, three weeks in the field and then come back in. We crowd that lag finally. Everything looks great with this guy. We actually castrated him because they were running in a f field space. And we we wanted to turn him out with all the other horses and, and fillies if he had to be, and we can't do that. He's a stud, obviously. So we ended up that ended up being his undoing. His castrating was because of fullness of the firm. So uh, no chance in Hill is now a gelding. It's not going to hurt him. And um, out in the firm soon to play. I think Mike said Wednesday he can go out. Mike? Dr. Latessa, yeah. Um, oh, Snap U is out in the field. We'll bring her back. Probably end. Up. What? Oh, snap you. Oh, snap. Do you know that horse? Oh, snap you? Yeah. She's pretty. Yeah. She's going to come back in. Don't put that on the ground, babe. Don't do that. Oh, That's all right. You can turn it up there. Uh -huh. Um. So, Old Snap, you'll come back in the first part of uh, December, end of November, somewhere in there. Paycheck Princess is back in now, actually. I know. Pickpockets going to the Breeders' Crown on Thursday. Pretty excited about that. Prince Charmer. Is uh, he'll be out probably till December fifteenth. We'll bring him back in. He's going to be a giant next year. Uh, he too was castrated. Pull the shoes. Uh, I'm going to give her till December fifteenth. Also, punch the clock is jogging. We're going to jog her probably straight. Oh, mommy's home. Right there. 
we're going to jog, uh, punch the clock straight through till, uh, we're going to jog, punch the clock straight through till, um, uh, Halloween and then give her a month. Um, <laughs> no. Um, what do we got now? Purple People Eater is going to be out till around December the 1st. You can get out. You can go see mom. Till around December the 1st. Uh, ready for landing. We'll be coming over to Ohio probably in a couple weeks. He's ready to start training. Uh, maybe not a couple of weeks. Maybe I'll, but I am going to bring him over here at some point. Uh, really don't. Close the door, babe. Really don't care. Uh, we'll be out till around December the 15th. Uh, really don't care. I'll be out till around December the 15th and we'll bring her back in. Rito's lady is training good. She can't be too far away from the races. I don't think Rito's lady, maybe three, four weeks. Uh, Royal Emeralds will bring back in around December the 1st ish. Get her back going. Seasons of love has been going. I suspect she's starting to train already in Ontario. Sedona Hill will be out till December 1st. Uh, now here's the trickiest one. Sunset Acres girl. There's no real rush to bring her back in until we know when her first stake race in Michigan is because there's not a lot of places to race her. Although all of her races, I think were considered fair races. So she'd fit a maiden at Northfield. I still don't want to have her ready too far before the sire stakes. So I'll have to talk to Donnie about that when her stakes are supposed to start back up, but had a great year. I think she's, she won what seven races or eight races and made almost 60 grand. Had a great year with Sunset Acres Girl for sure. Sweeney, uh, December 1st, will bring this guy back in. Uh, third and six is back jogging and training right now in Ontario. Time is on my side. We'll come back in sometime in uh, mid to late November. We'll bring him back in. Uh, Vaccaro Blue Chip looks great in the field. He'll come back in December 1st. Victory Blue Chip will likely come back middle of November. Um, watch your mouth will remain out probably till December 15th and widespread panic. I'll probably bring him in November 15th. So now you have it. Now you're up to date and this will be a running tally every week for you guys. But now you know about all the two year olds, three year olds, four year olds. You got our opening. It's been a great week here at the stable and it continues to be a great year for us. Very happy. And even more often, if you look even further down the road, not only did we have a wonderful 2023, the horses you've allowed us to pick up for 2024 already um, should make a huge splash for us. So hopefully. So with that, I'm going to let you go. I'll talk to you all very soon. Have a wonderful week ahead. Take care.